Hello. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. <laughs> Hi. Very How good. are you today? How are you today? Mm. Very good. good. Are you okay? What yes. do you see? Temblor en el estómago. Aún. 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 Aquí tengo mi tecito de manzanilla. <laughs> A little earthquake. Air little oh. uh, But I was in a second floor because I live in a second floor and was, uh, I guess, was worse that one. If you feel it in the first floor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, really. What about you? Uh, worry, teacher. Uh, with a lot of butterflies in my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but uh, all nice. All, all very good, yes. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> well, sounds good. We are alive. So I don't know. I haven't seen the news. I don't know. Have you seen the news? If there are uh, emergencies. Uh, I don't know if there, there are emergencies or... So. In some places, no. Mm, no, no, no. Only that the uh, um standing in the supermarkets, uh, every uh -huh. bottle, the bottles of the of the soda or the other thing in the in the floor. Yeah. <laughs> in the oh San Miguel, in the La Paz. I imagine that. Yes, estante, como se dice, Maria Leticia. Shell. Shell. <laughs> Yo se me había olvidado. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Stand? Yeah, no. Okay. Imagine, imagine, um, the, um, I don't know, the, the glasses, uh, the bottle glass, I don't know, in the supermarket. Yeah, yeah they will probably. Lost money there. Yeah, I know. All, all broke, teacher. All broken. <laughs> all broken, right? <laughs> How about you, Robertillo? <laughs> Robertillo, are you there? Robert, oh. are you there? Hello. Hello, mm -hmm. good evening, everyone. Yeah, How are you? Nice, nice. How about you with the with the earthquakes? Oh, in my case, Mira all, me. all very nice because um, when the earthquake passed, I I stay uh, out with my house. Really? <laughs> yes. But I feel I feel hard in La Libertad. Did you go the skater? No. No. Oh. oh, you are in La Libertad, right, Robert? Yes, I live in La Libertad, but I feel very hard the hair quite. Uh, I, I think the epicentro was in Usulután, is right? Yeah. Yes, yes. Was in Usulután. You keep calm. Lady Joanna, how do you feel the hair quite in Morazan? Oh, yeah, Morazan, right? Wow, the Morazan is Lady Joanna. Yes. yes. Really? Yeah, I'm from Morazan. Really good. Yes. Uh, um, far to, to me. Oh, <laughs> uh, really? Yeah. She was asleep, says Lady. <laughs> yo no sentí el temblor, yo no sentí el temblor. Ah, okay, okay, that is why it is just. <laughs> okay. 
Ang gusto mo niya rin. Sino na how to answer that question? Because uh, she doesn't know how to answer the question because she didn't play it. Okay. Teacher. Yes, Robert? Teacher. I like the activity we had practiced yesterday at night where because the old partner uh, they 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 give a an different answer uh, about the question in my opinion this is a good activity because because all i i study in i oh en otras palabras este nos ponemos en qué pensar pues y y respondemos con más emoción cuando nos hacen preguntas así sin saber que a nosotros nos va a tocar. Fue una buena actividad. Ok. Ok, well, thank you so much for your opinion. Very good. Well, we are going to continue doing activities like that, if you like it. Ok. Well, let me share my screen. I guess I'm doing that. Yes. Okay. Good. Today is July 18th, 2023, class number 11. Um, we have a lesson objective. That is the agenda for today. We have a lesson objective. Then we have human resources information and a conversation practice at the end. Okay. Um, the main objective for this lesson will be that you identify specific information of the human resources staff, organization, and their responsibilities within the department, okay? So it means that, that we are going to learn vocabulary related to human resources today. And at the end, we're going to make a conversation or, well, at the end, we're going to discuss how to do that activity but we'll, you will work in group of five. Two of you would be the from human resources. Okay, you're going to to act van actuar that you are from human resources, and three will be possible candidates to apply for a job position. So you're going to interview the three of them, and then the two that are the, that are the ones that will be in human resources are going to decide to hire just one of the candidates, okay? So to see well, what is the best candidate that you have when you interview. So it means that if you want to be uh, selected or hired from human resources, it could be any company. So you have to answer um, all the questions in a good way, okay? Okay, that will be the final activity. I hope that you like it and enjoy it. Okay, I have here vocabulary related to human resources, okay? Uh, try to read all of them and think what will be the best um option, for example, for employee engagement. Read all of them and tell me what will be the best answer for employee engagement. What's the meaning en engagement, teacher? Engagement is the level of um, como I don't know how to explain it in English, but pero qué tanto está entregado usted a su a su trabajo comprometido. Uh -huh. Okay. So that can that can um affect your performance and the results that you have in the company. Mm -hmm. 
What will be the correct option for employee engagement? Is number one, the process of setting, measuring, improving yeah. employee performance. The level of an employee, of employee and emotional. emotional and intellectual. Okay, so it means that will be the, the last one, right? The level of employees, emotional and intellect, intellectual investment in their job in and the organization, which affects their performance and satisfaction. Okay, good. Very good. Performance management. Look, the one for performance ma management. The process of attracting, screening, and selecting job apl applicants to file vacancies in our an organization. Mm. I think that is recruitment. Mm -hmm. For me, perform performance management is the first one. Mm -hmm. The process of seeding, measuring, and reviewing employee performance. It's Goals personal, and providing right? feedback, yes. Okay. And action were necessary. Correct, correct. And the and the one that that says Robert, the process of attracting screen screening and selecting job up applicants to fill vacancies in an organization that is recruitment. Okay. Recruitment. Okay. The the that is that department, right? Where yeah. they work hiring people, yes. What the difference between you says recruitment about the hiring or hiring? Hiring. Okay, recruitment is like uh, reclutamiento. Okay, it's like that. That is the name of that department. When you just call the people, but you have to select. Mm -hmm. You hire one. You. Uh, have to be past the process to select the people. Correct. Okay. The first step is recruitment and the second step is hire, but over your selection. Okay. It's a process of the human resource. Correct. Both. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All of them, all the ones that are, you can see yeah. here, are uh, Train, vocabulary. training training development the processes on and I think employee cannot now no. follow the skill and ability through so formal education and learning opportunities. Mm -hmm. That is correct. The process of enhancing employees' knowledge, knowledge. skills. Knowledge and abilities through formal education and learning opportunities. Okay, that will be training development. And the other one will be the total compensation and benefits is the total, let me see. I was not able to read it. <laughs> oh no. I don't have an option. Uh -huh. It is the total package of financial and non-financial rewards offered to employees in exchange for their work, including base salary, bonuses, and perks. Yeah, that. Teacher, uh, no se mira la pantalla. No se ve? No, negra me sale totalmente. <coughs> Sí, sí se ve. Yo sí la veo. Yo la veo también. I guess it's your internet connection. Try to leave the meeting and try to get in again, okay? Maybe that helped you. Uh-huh. Okay. What is recruitment? Who remember that? Recruitment. Mm -hmm. 
Who remember that? The question is one. The process of the drafting, screening, and selecting your compliance to fill mm -hmm. vacancies in the organization. Three. Mm -hmm. Number three. Training and, and development. Mm -hmm. What's this one, right? The level of employee. Okay, and then we have employment engagement. Mm -hmm. What is employment engagement? Do you remember? The process of enhancing employees' knowledge, skills, and abilities. So formal education and learning opportunities. Number four. Sorry, employment oh, engagement, employment engagement. Oh no, I guess it's this one. I made a mistake here. The level of employee emotion. Uh huh. Yes, I'm sorry. And this one is training development and then performance management is here. Okay, good. Tell me, do you have questions about these terms? Because there are terms from human resources. I'm not sure what's meaning enhancing, enhancing. And enhancing. It is in... It's como mejor. Yes. Mm -hmm. What is like it? Too, maybe. What is it? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. In which term? ¿Cuál término lo tenemos? Um, the first. Oh, the, and then the yeah. Yes. Um, it is a level of Improvement, uh -huh. quality. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, there you have all of them. What else? Another question that you may have about uh, vocabulary? No? Okay, good. So perks, we're going... Sir, excuse me, what's mean perks? Oh, perks. Yes. Uh, it is also related to, to rewards that you can earn in your job. It's like an advantage, maybe. Uh -huh. Additional uh -huh. money that you can receive. Ah, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's like a for fee. Ex for example, um, if you get like a gift card, it could be uh -huh. a perk. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay. Something good. Yeah, okay, okay. Good. Uh, we're going to continue. Oh, simple present questions review, the one that we have pending. The one that we have pending from yesterday. Let me see. I have here the names. Katy, Cindy, and Gilberto. Silvia, dice a teacher, perdón, se le escucha a lo lejos. Katy, Cindy, and Gilberto. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. the, one, the ones that uh, participated yesterday, but if you want to participate, you can do it too. Ok. Uh, ready, Gilberto? Yeah. Okay. Uh, 
Who will be the the interviewee? Cindy. Cindy. Okay. Are you there? Are you here, Cindy? Mm. Hello. I hear the chief. Okay. Uh, Salvador. Cindy Hello. is here. Cindy is here. If I want to interview Cindy, yes, she can answer your question. Gilberto. Okay. Cindy. Cindy. Hola. Hola, Gilberto. Okay. Uh, what is your name, the company? Mm, my company is AES El Salvador. Okay. Uh, what is what is the what is what is the company? Cindy. Oh, she said that is AES El Salvador. That is the company name. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Uh, uh, when, when, when is the vacation in the company? Ayana. Cindy, when do you have vacations in your company? Ah, vacation, which occupation, sorry. You said vacations or occupation, Gilberto? Vacation. Yeah, when do you have vacations in your company? When? In, I have vacation in August. August? In, in July. In July, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, what have the occupation in the company? What is your occupation in the company? What is what is the occupation in the company? I am a cashier. Okay, good night. Okay, good. Thank you, Gilberto. Gilberto, also the first question. What is your company name? That is the correct question, okay? Okay. What is your company name? What is your company name? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Cindy, now is your turn. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, uh, Gilberto. Okay, okay. Gilberto. <laughs> okay. Uh, Gilberto, do you like travel the mountain? Or the beach? Mm, I travel very the beach. Yeah, okay. Uh, do you have sister or brother? Uh, yes, I have three sisters and, and two brothers. Okay, and what is your favorite food? No, our favorite uh, artes, artes marciales. Your favorite sport or your favorite food? Um, favorite food. Food. Ah, food. Food. Oh. What you eat? Oh, see, I favorite food. Pupusas. Okay, typical food. Oh, also chicken. Okay, yeah. thank, you. thank you. Okay, so Cindy, the first question, do you like to travel? Mm -hmm. Do you like to travel? Do you like to travel? Mm -hmm. To okay. mountains or, or beach? Or, or you can, uh, or 
or you can change the question. You can uh, ask him, uh, what do you prefer? Okay, what do you prefer? Mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. Going to the mountains or the beach, okay? Okay, good. Uh, Kathy, are you here? Kathy, she's not available, I can't see. Okay, well, we're going to continue. Who else uh, wants uh, to participate in this activity? If if you didn't participate yesterday and, and today you want to participate, you can um, let me know. I can give you the time to do it. Nobody? Okay, no problem. Okay, try to think in this question, okay? Because today we're going to start unit three that um, it is about human resources department. Okay, what do you know about the human resources department in your company? Make a list, okay? Write a list about what you know about the human resources, okay? I will give you four or five minutes to do that, and then I will ask you. Try to make a list. Hello. Hello, Salvador. Good evening, teacher. I think uh, human resource and uh, responsibilities are recruitment, mm -hmm. administration, uh, uh, comp compensation and benefit. Mm -hmm. Uh, training and development. Okay. Ba basically. <laughs> ba basically. Basically. Okay. Thank you so much. Yes. Yeah. That can define uh, some responsibilities that they have. Okay. Good. Someone else? A different opinion that you may have. <clears throat> In chair, a human department, it is tasked with maximizing employee productivity. And it will be diversity and inclusion. Mm -hmm. Okay. Fighting. Hiding. Fighting, yes. Recruitment, compensation and benefit. Um keeping up to date with any louds. Okay. Update the employees. Yes. With any change in the company. Okay. Yes, of course. Okay, good. For me, they are the responsible for the recruitment, the manage the compensations and benefits, pay the role. Uh, uh, I mean, um, they are the 
they are the responsible for uh, the administration of, of payroll and they are, they are responsible too for when we have to, to dismiss somebody for results or for, for anything. I think that is the one important function for them. Functions that they have. Okay, good. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, another idea. Teacher, in my case, in my company, the human resources are the people that make the schedule for the activities that well, it's like that uh, uh, all the employees uh, have to follow in the week. Mm -hmm. and because in my company give us the lunch. Okay. They, they write in the whiteboard on the lunch room and the menu for the different food that we are going to eat in the week. Okay. Good. And of course, they are they are the the responsibilities who make or create the payroll for a, any for all the employees who receive the payment. Okay, good. Wow, good benefits. Jose Andres has a good job. Yeah, yeah. My company <laughs> give me give me all the uh, every day my lunch. Okay. <laughs> I would benefit. Yeah, <laughs> because you save money there. You don't buy food, right? Andres, okay. Uh, what kind of food they provide? Uh huh. What kind of food they give? They give you, Andres. Uh, uh, all the food for feet, uh, meat, um, chicken breath, um, soups. But because I don't, I don't eat, I don't like uh, the fish when. When I when is the day that they give, they give us fish, the company give us fish, I don't write my name in the list, so I don't I don't eat this day. I have to to buy my my lunch. <laughs> <laughs> and really? Yeah, Andres, yeah. I, I like, yeah. I have a question for you, Andres. Yes, tell me, Roberto. This benefit is only for the boss, as you or this benefit benefits is for the all per for the all employees for the all employees in the company administrator administ administ administration administration department administration for all the department yeah it's like a, a como, uh, <clears throat> yeah for for administration departments so for example for the security works no no, no, no. Just for for the employees that work in the company. They but have yes, vacancies. It's for, for, it's for everyone. Only administration people or employees. Yeah, only administration people. Yeah. Oh, okay. I I think this is a a good benefit for the administration employees. However, I think all people have right for for the same benefits, I mm -hmm. think so. Okay, yeah, that is true. The okay. day that you don't want the food, uh, Andres, you take take it and give it one of the security guards, then maybe they will. It, it, uh, it's, it's, not, it's not possible, teacher. It's, it's not, not possible? Pos if I don't write my name in the list, uh, they, they don't like, uh, they don't, they they don't no sé como piden mi comida. <laughs> they don't request uh, your food. No, yeah, but I but no, food. but I said um if you request it, okay, write your name. You request it, you take it. I can't. No, it is not allowed. It's like a, it's like a normal. It's like yeah, it's like a polite. They have, no, they no, have no, to see police. you eating. <laughs> yeah, 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 I have to if you because if I I take the the food. I, uh, I have to go to the lunch room. Uh -huh. We have an area that we can uh, lunch or uh, that we can lunch, that we can eat or lunch. Mm -hmm. So if, if I don't, for example, if I grab my name, I have to go and have to, and I have to eat my food here. 
No, they're but I can. The company. No, yeah, they're in the mm -hmm. company. Yeah, no, no, I can carry my the food and give it for someone else. Someone else. else. Uh, yeah, I okay. can't. <laughs> yes. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> well, but that is a good benefit. That a good benefit that, that you have. Okay. Good. Thank you so much, guys, right. for your uh, opinions. Okay. Yes. Sure. yes? In my Carlos. case, uh, the launch the launch on employees have a, a I don't know how to say sub subsidy or subsidy. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, because the price of the launch is very very uh, uh, lower. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's is cheaper than the normal cheaper. food, right? Yeah, yeah, of mm -hmm. course. Yes. It's cheaper. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Subsidy. It's okay. Subsidy. Subsidy. Mm -hmm. Subsidy. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that is another benefit. Good. The chair. Yes, Robert. In my company, there are uh, different subsidies. For example, in the morning, all the people get a uh, coffee free. Mm -hmm. really? Yeah, in the morning, all the people coffee. Coffee free in the morning for the breakfast, yeah. And for the lunch, the company subsidy for 50% of the lunch. 50? The, oh. other, the other 50 <clears throat> is responsible for the employees. Responsibility. Other, yeah. Other benefit is the company uh, give a... Uh, a transportation for for your house in the morning and in the afternoon. Wow, yes. that is yes. really good. Me too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. It, it doesn't matter where you buy your food, you have the 50% or you, ha you have a specific place to buy that food, in, to have that 50%. It is for the for the all lunch. For example, if you if you want to eat chicken, if you want to eat bistec, if you want to eat spaghetti, oh, they, they it, have their, own, is, is their own cafeteria. At cafeteria, yeah. Ah, okay, okay, yeah, okay, good. Yes, good. What do you say, rellena de papas? <laughs> uh, potato with uh, potato filling, cheese right? or, potato filling. or meat in, <laughs> inside. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay good. No, don't worry, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is that is like a, I don't know Salvadoreño yeah. <laughs> recipe. <laughs> uh, yeah, recipe. Recipe. Uh huh. Okay. Um, potato feel of this feeling or something i don't know mm -hmm. yeah or you can say potato with uh, eh, i don't know what I have inside <laughs> <laughs> okay cheese. cheese and uh, what else we can add to the relleno the cheese that you seen with the pupusa right mm -hmm. El queso chicloso. Mm, like cheddar cheese? Mm, no. No, the, the, the pupusa inside to the, uh, be, in between to the pop, the potato. Yeah. Uh, then, uh, I don't know. Quesillo. Uh, quesillo. I don't know how to say quesillo. Yeah. <laughs> Quesillo. Quesillo. Okay. Or you can say baked stuff with potato, right? Si son horneadas or um, mm -mm. 
twice, bake it potato. I don't know. There are different like uh, recipes with that kind of uh, res uh, kind of kind of ingredients. Yes. Okay. Uh, let me see. We have this um, conversation. It is about Mr. Chang is looking for two employees at RC company. Listen to you. Okay. Let me read it for you first and then you are going to repeat it. Okay. Um, it says, Mr. Chang, excuse me, I'm looking for Mrs. Chavez. No, Mr. Chavez. Can you tell me, uh, no, this case, MR is Mr. and MS is Mrs. Okay, Mrs. Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Sure. Is the recruitment coordinator? I see. And could you tell me about her responsibilities? Basically, she provides recruiting administrative support for the team and recruiters. I understand. And does Mr. Salgado work here? What does he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado, he is the talent management consultant. Where can I reach him? He returned at one o'clock. Okay, as you can see, uh, someone is asking for someone else, right? And asking what are the, the activities or responsibilities that that person does. Okay, I need volunteers who wants to read this, okay? One will be Mr. Chan and the other will be Dorian. Okay, lady, thank, thank you. Sure. Robert, okay. Okay, Robert, you will be Mr. Shang and lady will be Dorian. Keep your hands raised if you want to participate, okay? Okay, teacher. Lady, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, excuse me. I am looking for Miss Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Sure. She is the recruitment coordinator. I see. And could you tell me about her responsibilities? Basically, she provides recruiting administrative support for the team on recruiters. I understand. Um, does Mr. Salgado work here? What does he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado. He is the talent management consultant. Where can I reach him? He returns at one o'clock. Okay, okay very thanks. good. Very good. Thank you so much. Do you have questions about vocabulary that you may find there? Sure. What do you mean rich? It's rich. like uh, localization, maybe. Yeah, like contacting. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. You can reach me at and I can in, and I can give you my phone number, right? So uh, okay. if that is that is another option to say. You can call me at, you can say also, you can reach me. Okay, good. Uh, now will be Gilberto and Maria Leticia. Okay. Okay. Really, Maria, Leti Maria Leticia? Really. Excuse me, I am looking for Miss Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Sure. She is the recruitment coordinator. I see. I'll call you tell me about her responsibility. Bicycle. She provides recruiting administrative support 
for the thing of requires. I understand. And that's Mr. Sargado. Where he, what does he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado. He is the talent management consultant. Where can I reach him? To return at one o'clock. Thank you. He returns at one o'clock. Okay, good. Recruitment. Repeat that. Recruitment. Recruit Recruitment. 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 Okay. She the recruitment. Recruit. Recruitment. 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 The letter E, la E, no la, no la, no la, no tiene sonido. It's silent. Recruitment. 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 Yeah. Recruitment. Recruit. Recruitment. Recruiting. Recruitment. And uh, the other one is recruit, recruited. Mm -hmm. Okay, recruitment. 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 Coordinator and then the recruitment. administrative support. Recruitment. Coordinator. And, uh huh. And then the recruit recruiters. Okay. Good. Uh, thank you so much, Maria and, and Gilberto. Now, Mauricio and Silvia. Okay. Excuse me, I'm looking for Mrs. Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Silvia? Are you there, Silvia? Estela? Okay. Uh, Carlos, can you do it with uh, Mauricio? Uh, I will be Mr. Chen. You will be okay. Dorian. Okay. Excuse me. I am looking for Carlos. Can you tell me? Mauricio, are you there? No. Yeah, um, sure. She is the recruitment coordinator. Uh, I see. Um, could you tell me about her responsibilities? Basically, she provides recruiting administrative support for the team of recruiters. I understand. Um, does Mr. Salgado work here? Yeah. Hola, hola. Yes, Mateo Salgado, he is the talent management consultant. And uh, where can I reach him? Returns at one o'clock. Okay, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Carlo. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Teacher, perdón que el micrófono me estaba fallando. Ah, oh, okay. Uh -huh. Okay, Silvia, no problem. You will uh, participate. Está temblando de nuevo. Really? Sí. Millina. No. Aquí no. Está temblando, sí, está temblando, sí. Sí. Sí, sí. Acá te, sí. sí está temblando. ¿Ah? Sí, 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 ya empezó. Uh -huh. Ahorita. Ya sentí. Ay, chico. Ya, ya sentí. Ya, ya, ya. Ya se sentí acá. Sí, ya se me terminó el té. Te crece. <laughs> okay, but the the so uh, más suave, so más suave. Uh -huh, sí, 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 más cortito. Oh no. Okay. Qué miedo, ya no vamos a poder dormir tranquilo. <laughs> yeah. Day off, teacher. Mañana será suerte por el susto de ahora. Esa reprise. Okay, si me ve que salgo por esa puerta, ya no voy a volver a entrar. <laughs> Ahí vamos a quedar, teacher. teacher. <laughs> I know. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, Julio and Liliana, you can continue. Okay. Okay. We need, um, excuse me. I'm looking for Mrs. Chavez. Can you tell me who you cheese? Sir, she is the present. Recruitment coordinator. I see. And could you tell me about her responsibilities? Basically, the, she provides recruiting. Administratrice, I know. Support for the team of recurring. I understand. And um, does Mr. Salgado work here? What does he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado. He is the talent. Ma 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 Management. Man Management. Consultant. Manager. Consultant. Uh, where can I reach him? Here returns at one o'clock. Thank you, Lily. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, Lily. So please pay attention to the others uh, that were um, pronounce the conversation. We need to improve a lot of. Uh, words okay um for example here recruit recruitment okay recruitment coordinator uh, basically no basically 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 she provides she provides recruiting administrative support for the for the team of recruiters okay Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, he is the talent management consultant. Management. Yeah. He exactly. returns. Returns at one o'clock. Returns at. Okay. Thank you. Please. Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you, Julian Liliana. Now, William and Jose Andres. Okay. Good. Um, yes. I Yes. Yeah, yeah, you can start. Oh, right. oh, when are you present? Excuse me, I'm looking for Miss Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Sure, she is the recruitment coordinator. I see. And could you tell me about her responsibilities? Basically, she provides recruiting administrative support for the of requirements. I understand. And does Mr. Salgado work here? What does he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado. He is the talent management consultant. Management? Uh, management cons consultant. 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 Okay. Where can I reach him? He returns at one o'clock. Okay, okay, thank you. Thank you. Now, Sylvia and Cindy. Sylvia and Cindy. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Who mm -hmm. starts? Cindy or you? Anyone. But excuse me. I am looking, Mr. Mr. Chavez. Can you tell me who she is? Sure, sure. She is the recruitment coordinator. I see. And cool. You tell me about the responsibility. Basically, she provides recruiting and administrative support for the team of recruiters. I understand. And uh, that's Mr. Salgado. We're here. What does uh, he do? Yes, Mateo Salgado. He is the talent management consultant. 
Where can I read him? He returns at one o'clock. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. very good. Thank you. Okay, repeat this word again. Recruitment. 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 Okay, olviden que aquí está una I. Vea, como que hagan cuenta como que solo hay una U. Recruitment. Recruitment coordinator. ¿O cómo sería ahí? Recruitment. Recruitment. Recruit, recruitment coordinator. Recruitment. Recruitment. Recruitment coordinator. Recruit. Recruit. Recruitment. Recruitment. Yeah. Okay. And here. Recruiting. 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 Recruitment. Recruiting. Recruiting here. Recruiting. <clears throat> recruiting. Recru. Re I'm sorry. Is recruiting. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. I am sorry. I will send uh, the link where you can practice the pronunciation, okay? I guess I have sent it to you before the, the online dictionary, but you can practice these words that you have difficulties to pronounce. Um, you can have more time to, to practice then, okay? Recruiter. Recruiters. Recruiter. Recruiter. Ok. Hagan cuenta que aquí no existe la I, porque eso no se pronuncia, ok. Recru recruitment, recruiting, and recruiters. Ok. Ok. Good job here, guys. Thank you so much for your participation. And take note um, the difficult words for you and practice them, ok. Practice them for you, okay? Because that is that will be for you, okay? I don't know how you work on your learning process, but yes, that will be one of the um, advantages or ways that you can improve your learning pronunciation, okay? Okay. Just practicing. Okay. Here it says, discuss the following question. Who is Mr. Chavez? What do you think about Mr. Shand Dust? Who is Mr. Chavez? Uh -huh. According to the conversation, who is Mr. Chavez? I'm oh, sorry, Mrs. Chavez. She, mm -hmm. she recruitment coordinator. Recruitment coordinator. Recruitment coordinator. Okay, good. And who is, uh, or no, what do, do you think Mr. Chang does? Mm -hmm. Do you think that Mr. Chang uh, work in that company or not? Mm, yeah. So Mr. Chavez find the Mr. No, Mr. Ch Mr. For... Chang. Uh, Mr. Chang find the Mr. Chavez. He's looking for. Looking for Mr. Chavez. Looking for Mr. Chavez. Uh huh. He doesn't work in that company, right? Probably he's um, someone who wants to apply in the company because he's asking about what are the roles for the ones that work there. Or maybe he wants to offer his benefits to the company. Probably, probably he worked for another company 
and he wants to offer some benefits to the company. And he is interested uh, to speak with Mrs. Chavez. Hi, Mr. Salgado, right? It could be. Okay, good. Ya pueden bajar su mano, los que tienen la mano levantada. Okay. Read the information about each, each R personal, then answer the questions below. Okay. Who wants to help me to read? Recruit, recruitment coordinated. Me, teacher. Mm -hmm. Recruitment coordinator. Bachelor's degree. Mm -hmm. Organized schedule for off candidate interviews. Open and post requisitions. Requisitions. Mm -hmm. Coordination requisitions. Coordinates internal and internal job postings. Uh, has a degree in management. Work with and supports and recruiting team. Has five years of experience. Works on week weekdays and works part time okay good those are like the 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 benefits that are or the working responsibilities that a recruitment coordinator will have okay okay good uh okay pay attention to all of them because when you interview your classmates you are going to interview them for one of these positions. It could be recruitment coordinator, okay? Benefits specialist, talent management consultant, human resource generalist, okay, one of them. Okay, uh, who wants to read benefits specialist? Me teacher. Okay. okay. Benefit specialist, bachelor's degree, develops and man, maintains competitive, progr progressive, and proactive compensation plans, creates cost-effective benefit programs to provide motivation, incentivize and rewards for effective performance, works on week, weekdays, part-time job, three years of experience in this position. Okay, very good. Incentive. Okay, incentives. Incentive. Incentive. Incentives. Mm -hmm. Incentive. Okay, teacher. Okay, good. Thank you. Reading the benefits at specialist. Okay. Now, um, talent management consultant. Who wants to read that? Me, Wilbur. teacher. Wilbur. Go ahead. Go ahead, Wilbur. Partnership develop, develop, development, uh, career development, assesses performance learning and development works on Saturday, full-time job, one year of experience. Okay, I didn't hear you at the beginning, okay? But it start with bachelor degree, okay? Responsible for leadership development, career development, assesses performance learning and de development, works on Saturday, full-time job and what year of, of experience okay all these um mm, requirements right need to have a candidate for this position okay what about human resources generalist who wants to read it lady here, here this is, oh. okay lady lady do you want to participate right Yes. Okay, go ahead. 
human resource generalist, bachelor's degree, maintains knowledge of legal requirements, and government reporting regulation affect human resource, responds to inquiries regarding policies, procedures and programs, works on Saturday, part-time job, five years of, of experience in similar positions. Okay, good. Legal. Legal. So the, the, the letter E, yeah, it sounds like a E, right? Legal. Requirements. Okay. Very good. Okay. Uh, remember all these positions because your team will choose one of them. Inquiry. 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 Okay. Here. Inquiries. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Answer the questions made by an external auditor. What is that the recruitment coordinator do? What is the recruitment coordinator experience? When does the re recruitment coordinator work? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we have yeah. questions about the recruitment coordinator. Yes, Gilberto? Uh, re recruitment coordinator has five year of experience, okay. work on weekdays, work part-time. Mm -hmm. Good, on weekdays and part-time. Okay, that is good, good job, good schedule. Okay, what else? What, what does he do or she, your, or she do? Organizes schedules of candidates' interviews, opens and post requisitions, and coordinate oh. internal and uh, internet job posting. Right? Yes. And works with a support rec recruitment team. Okay, that are the, like the responsibilities. Then he or she has or needs a uh, bachelor degree, five years of experience. Okay, and work on weekdays and part time. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Okay, good. Here I have a conversation. Okay, it is just an example because that later you are going to do the conversation in group of five. Uh, one will be. Two will be from HR and three will be f uh, applying for a job in the company. Okay, but first we're going to read a conversation that we have here. This is a long conversation between Mike and John. Okay, because it's a job interview. I need two volunteers. Thank you, sir. Okay, Jose Andres and? Me. Okay, ah. Carlos. Okay, let me take notes because you will participate. Jose Andres, Carlos, then Mauricio, Lady, Robert. Maria Leticia. Thank you. Okay, first Ho Jose Andres and Carlos. Okay, Jose Andres, it will be Mike and Carlos will be John. Okay. Are you okay. ready? Yeah. Okay. okay. Good morning, John. I am Mike. Good morning. How are how are you doing? Uh I am doing fine. Thank you. How was the traffic coming over, over there, over here? 
I am so glad that the traffic was light this morning. No traffic jam and no accident. That, that is good, John. Let us start the interview. Are you ready? Yes, I am. First of all, let me properly introduce myself. I am the finance department manager. As you know, there is an open position in my, in my department and I need to fill this position as soon as possible. Please tell me a little bit about the position. It is an entry level position. The new employee will have to work closely with the accounting department. He will also have to deal with the bank on a daily basis. What type of qualification do you require? I require a four-year college degree in finance. Some working experience could be helpful. What kind of experience are you looking for? Doing office work is good. However, since this is an entry level position, I do not require a lot of experience. I'm willing to try the new person. That's great. John, tell me a little bit about yourself. Uh, I was a student at West Coast University and I just graduated with a bachelor degree in finance. I have been working part time as a payload player for the last two years. What are you looking for in a job? Uh, the job should help, help me see what finally is all about. I have learned a lot of finance theories at school. And now it is time for me to put them into practice. Anything else? I also hope that it will help me grow in my field. 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 What are your strengths? What should I hire you? I am a hard work person and a fast learner. I am very eager to learn and I get along fine with people. Okay, now let me ask you a few quick questions. You don't, you don't mind working long hours, do you? No, I do not. Can you handle pressure? Yes, I can. When I was going to school, I took quite a few courses each semester while working at least 20 hours every week. Um, I handled that situation very well. Do you still have any question for me? No, I think I had a pretty good understanding of the job. I believe that I can handle it with it's easy. And I hope that I have to the opportunity to work for you. John, nice meet nice meeting you. Thank you for coming. Nice meeting you too. Thank you for seeing me. <laughs> okay, thank you, Carlos. Thank you, Andres. Okay, was good. And at the end, we didn't know if that he was high. <laughs> because he said nice to meeting you. Really? We are going to call you. <laughs> We're going we to call, call you. you later. Okay, another yeah. day. Okay, good. Okay, look at this uh, conversation. is is uh, very good, but it's about a interview conversation, right? As you can see, they start uh, talking about the traffic at the beginning, just to introduce each other. How was your uh, way coming here? Um, and then they start working about the position, right? Okay, good. Similar to this one, you are going to try to do your conversation. Okay, uh, Mauricio and Lady, go ahead. Okay. Good morning, John. I am Mike. Good morning. 
How are you doing? I am doing fine. Thank you. How was the traffic coming over here? I am so glad that the traffic was light this morning. No traffic jam and no accidents. That is good. Young, let's start the interview. Are you ready? Yes, I am. First, first, first of all, let me properly let me properly introduce myself. I am the finance department manager. As you know, there is an open position in my department, and I need to fill this position as soon as possible. Please tell me a little bit about the position. No, she Please. will ask you about that. Uh -huh. Oh, sorry. Yes. Please, please tell me a little bit about the position. It is an entry level position. The new employee will have to work closely with the, with the accounting department. He will also have to deal with the bank on a daily, on a daily basis. Basis. What type of qualification do you require? I require a four year college degree in finance. Finance. Some working finance in finance. Some working experience will be helpful. What kind of experience are you looking for? Uh, doing office work is good. However, since this is an entry level position, I don't require a lot of experience. I am willing to train the new person. That is great. Young, tell me a little bit about yourself. I was a student at West Coast University. And I just graduated with a bachelor degree in finance. I have been working part time as a payroll clerk for the last two years. What are you looking for in a job? The job show helped me see what finance is all about. I have learned a lot of finance theories at the school. And now it is time for me to put them into practice. Anything else? I also hope that it will help me grow in my field. Where are you strange? Why should I hear you? I am a hardworking person and a fast learner. I am very eager to learn and I get along fine with people. Okay, now let me ask you a few quick questions. Do you don't mind working long hours, do you? No, I don't. I don't Can know. you handle, okay. Can you handle pursuit? Are you sure? Yes, I Pressure? Yes, I can. When I was going to school, I took quite a few girls each semester while working a little 20 hours every week. And I handled that situation very well. Do you still have any, do you still have any questions for me? No, I think I have a pretty good understanding of the job. I believe that I can handle it with ease and I have to have the opportunity to work for you. Youngs, nice meeting you. Thank you for coming. Nice meeting you too. Thank you for seeing me. Okay. okay. Curses, because that is plural here, okay, lady? 
Curses. Curses. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Now will be Robert and Maria Leticia. <clears throat> okay, teacher. Okay. Good morning, John. I am Mai. Good morning. How are you doing? I am doing fine. Thank you. How was the traffic coming over here? I am so glad that traffic was like this morning. No traffic jam and no accident. That is good, John. Let's start the interview. Are you ready? Yes, I am. First of all, let me properly introduce myself. I am the finance department manager. As you know, there is an open position in my department and I need to fill this position as soon as possible. Please tell me a little bit about the position. It is a entry-level position. The new employee will have to work closely with the accounting department. He will also have to deal with the bank on a daily basis. What kind of qualif qualification do you require? Require. Require. I require a four-year college degree in finance. Some working experience would be helpful. What kind of experience are you looking for? What kind? Kind. Mm -hmm. Okay. What kind? Okay. What kind of experience are you looking for? Doing office work is good. However, seeing this is an entry level position, I do not require a lot of experience. I have willing to train to the new person. That is great. John, tell me a little bit about yourself. I was a student at the West Coast University and I just graduated with a bachelor degree in finance, <laughs> degree in finance. I have been working part-time as a payroll clerk for the last two years. What are you looking for in a job? The job should help me see what finance is all about. I have learned a lot of finance theories at school and now it is time for me to put things into practice. Anything else? I also hope that it will help me grow in my field. What are your strengths? Why should I hire you? I am a hardworking person and a fast learner. I am very eager to learn and I get along fine with people. Okay. Now, let me ask you a few quick questions. You do not mind working long hours, do you? No, I do not. Can you handle pressure? Yes, I can. When I was going to school, I took quite a few courses each semester while working at last 20 hours every week. And I handled that situation very well. Do you still have any question for me? No, I think I have a pretty good understanding. Understanding. Understand, understanding of the job. I believe that I can handle it with 
is, and I hope to have the opportunity to work for you. John, nice meeting you. Thank you for coming. Nice meeting you too. Thank you for saying me. Saying me. Okay. Saying me. Okay, very good. Good job. Thank you so much. Okay, remember a uh, pronunciation like this, okay? A strength. Strength. Yes. Should. Sure. Uh, sure. You don't you don't pronounce it the letter L, just the or the O, just the we should. Sure. Uh -huh. Just the H U D. Should. 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 Okay. Good. Okay, guys, I already sent a link to you. I know that you can have in your in your cell phone. This is the, you know, online. It is a website. You can read it. And you can take examples or phrases from this conversation in the one that you are going to do. So we are uh, 21, 21 students. Okay, so let me divide the group in four teams. I know that we can start working about that. So I don't know if you need more explanation or is it clear what you are going to do? Tell me. You're going to create one conversation similar to the one that you have uh, read. Two of you will be from HR. You will be evaluating the, the candidates, okay? The other three will be the candidates to, that apply for a job. And you are going to interview them, okay? All of them. And at the end, we are going to decide which candidate will be the one that you are going to hire. So if we don't finish the activity today, we're going to continue tomorrow, but then I, I want that you discuss and you practice, okay? What you are going to do and what kind of questions you are going to do in the, in the interview. Questions about that? No questions? Uh, yes, the chair, I have a question. Uh, mm -hmm. I can the interview with my partner, similar to conversation. Yeah, you're going to a conversation. You're going to create a conversation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Similar to the one that you have uh, that you have read, you can take some phrases from there, some ideas from there. Okay. Okay, in the first thing I have Carlos, Cindy, Daniela, Gilberto, and Hazel. You are the first team. Team number two will be Jose Andres, Julio, Katy, Lady, Liliana. Team number three, Maria Leticia, Robert, Mauricio. Rolando, Salvador. Okay, and then team number four, Wilber, Silvestella, Juliana, William Roque. I don't know if Carla y Dari, uh, are you there, Carla? Porque veo que está como oyente. Pero no sé si puede participar. Carla y Dari. No. Okay, let me go ahead and... Um, and open the rooms, okay? In order you can start working. If you don't have questions, let me open the rooms now.
Juliana and Wilbur Francisco, are you there? Wilbur? Can you hear me? Si me escucha. Tiene mute. Teacher. Yes, Wilbur. Eh, cuando entré me, a, la, al, a la sala, me, me sacó de la sesión. Eh, de, de todo, de, de, del Zoom. Ahorita recién volví a ingresar. Pero veo que, veo que aparezco dos veces ahí como conectado. En la, yes. donde están los participantes. Así, así veo. Ok. Let me try to send you again. Lo voy a enviar otra vez. Ahí está, ahí ya va a aparecer solo una vez. Ok. Lo voy a enviar otra vez. Ok. Ajá. Sí, sí, es por eso que la, de primero no lo grabé. ¿Cómo? Está desde la, la dos, desde el teléfono y desde la compu. Eh, del teléfono tengo todo apagado, solo de la compu tengo el speaker. En el teléfono ah, sí está la cámara, ajá, pero me falla. Yo no sé si está fallando el Inter o qué. Ajá. ajá. Vaya, veamos, vamos okay. a hacer a question, vea. Sí, solo teacher. Guys, yes, in this case will be only you two, solo ustedes dos, porque veo que Juliana no, no responde, ni tampoco la otra persona que estaba disponible. Entonces, solo ustedes dos. Uh, one will be the from HR, Human Resources, uh -huh. and the other will be the, the interviewee, ¿ok? ¿Quién está aplicando el trabajo? Ah, ok. Okay. So you decide who who will be the interviewee and who will be the human resources employee. Ah, okay. Okay, teacher. Ahorita decidimos. Okay, good. ¿Quién es el jefe y quién es el? Okay, good. Vaya, vaya yo ando buscando trabajo. Ya, vaya. Bueno, tres, porque los demás no responden. Ajá. Uh -huh. Hello, teacher. Hello, guys. How is everything here? Yeah, Era lo que yo quería, teacher. Okay, remember, one, okay, two of, two of you will be the, from human resources, you will be the interviewers, and three will be the, uh, the ones that are applying for the, for the job, okay? Ustedes van a inventar que tienen una empresa, que en qué empresa trabajan, y ustedes van a ser como los jueces que van a estar evaluando los new hires, okay? A los, los candidatos. Van a tener tres candidatos que van a aplicar a la position. Ustedes van a decir qué position tienen available. Las que vimos, okay? Pueden tomar una de esas. Puede ser Recruitment Coordinator, Benefits Specialist, Talent Management Consultant, or Human Resources Generalist. So, okay. so you are going to to provide like uh, what are the benefits that you have or what do you need? If you need five years of experience, what is the schedule that you have? And if you need that they have a bachelor degree or... Oh, and what will be the roles that they are going to do in the company? Okay. 
And also, uh, you're going to create the, the conversation, like the, the one that we read. Okay, there you have it in the chat. If you want to take a look and see the phrases or, or how to create equations. So you can use the, some phrases from there or okay. the examples. And um, that's it. So try to organize your ideas today. If we don't have time today, so you are going to perform that tomorrow, but try to organize your ideas, okay? Okay, teacher. Good. Thank you. You're welcome. Questions? No? Okay, guys. Uh, lo dejaré. But if you need help, just raise your hands and, and let me know, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Collaborator. 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 Tendría que iniciar este Liliana. My name is Liliana, and I am a collaborator person, y así va. Como una cinco que diga, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Sí, porque uh, podría ser nice to meet you. My name is este, Liliana. I'm going, to, I'm going to describe myself like a, I am a collaborator person, y ahí usted se suelta. Ahí usted escribe las demás de ahí cuando este terminaría Liliana pues puede comenzar con Katy Katy y lo mismo verdad my name is Katy and I'm going to describe myself I am a, y ahí usted escribe su, su personalidad y cuando termine Katy puede ya de last one pues, termina Julio y lo mismo ¿verdad? consecutivamente describe su su personalidad okay it means that uh, everybody will be uh, answering the the same questions right yeah teacher mm -hmm. okay good and at the end so you will be uh the ones that lady and, and jose andres you will be the ones that will decide who will be the the hiring person, right? Who will be hired? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Tell, tell me why, why do you want to work at this company? Why? Why? Uh -huh. uh, do you want to work? Why? Why do you no. want? No. Why do you? Why oh, do you want? Do you... Why? Do you want? Tell me why. In, in why? our company, verdad? Our why company. Do you, why do you want to work? company our company at at en o sea at. en esta ah, okay vaya en tu respuesta sería por, por ejemplo va maría leticia uh, in my in my case i want to work at this company because um, i see this company is very is very good and i always i want to work at this company un ejemplo es un ejemplo va de lo que tú puedes decir y, y similar la respuesta de los demás. The company I had a uh, 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 famous people también, ¿verdad? Ajá. 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 And, and I want to work in this company because the company pay a good salary, eh, $200, $2,000 for, for me. <laughs> ok. <laughs> Ok, un, un ejemplo, va, para que, y, y la número tres, porque no nos podemos acceder demasiado en el tiempo. Sí. Ajá. 
le, le agregamos una tercera o, o la cerramos hasta ahí o les digo yo después ah, puedes eh, hacer bueno. preguntas así como fáciles que si puedes usar tal cosa no sé así para pues, dos ah, tres entonces, entonces la hago general o sea ajá que para que ajá y cada uno va contestando así sí o no o sea eh, esta pregunta sería como te eh, can you can you can tell you try me a car or can you use the computer can ajá you pero como no sé yo no te la voy a, te la voy a hacer así detalle por detalle no que te la voy a hacer general Hello, William Roque, are you there? William? Can you hear me? William, hello. A responsibility y aquí se la aquí se la vamos a traducir bueno, ahí dice obligación y responsabilidades esenciales cuáles son ah, para la para la plaza sería ajá la que se está exacto sí sí eh, y no lo estamos lo teníamos que contestar no sabe eh, eh, no era como interactuar nada más con él. Con usted, a una plaza que, que usted esté ofreciendo en el ah, centro de servicios, digamos. Right. Entonces, ahí I, usted me dice cuáles the... son las, las responsabilidades <laughs> esenciales que hay yeah, que right. tener. I need the, eh, sería, ¿cómo le llaman a, a ustedes técnicos? ¿En qué? Espérenme, se, se me ha ido el nombre de esto, pero, pero ustedes son técnicos en, en sí, esa es la, la, son técnicos en, en elaboración, manejo de llaves, Sí, ¿verdad? eh, sí, eh, eh, técnico en cerrajería. Ah, cerrajería, eso. Sí, technician, Ajá, Ajá. technician, ¿qué? Kiss. Technician, <risa> ok. no, no. no. Looks, looks, meets. Looks, meet, meet. Uh -huh. Ah, va. Entonces sería eh, word location, dijimos. Eh, Contan. Contan. Department. What is a department? Uh... Ah, no, aquí sería, what is your other eh, employer? Así sería, ¿verdad? Ajá. What is your other employer? Sí, ¿verdad? Así sería. No sí, sé si está sería. preguntando bien o mal. Employment. ¿Sí? Employment. What is, employment. Do you have a, yeah, if you have another employment, Ajá. otro Ajá, trabajo, right? right? Yes, yes. Ajá. Ah, pues estamos bien. Employment. Ajá. Es a uh, Luxmith Technician. Luxmith Technician. Ok. Sería, dijimos que era part-time. Part-time. Part part uh -huh. Ah, no, ese, ese, ese sería full-time. El part-time. Full 
Ajá, es partido. Ajá. Ah, sería Ajá, es full time. Ajá. Tiempo completo. Sí. Ah, ok. Va, Ajá. entonces sería... De ahí sería esencial and responsibility. Ah, va, aquí sería... Eh, la responsabilidad es... Eh, como, como dijo ella que se decía? Espérame. En este caso, como es Lubricentro, necesitamos... Eh, I need the open in the workplace. Um, no, sería in the eh, 7, 7 a.m. Sí, así sería. Abrir, abrir a las... Ajá, 7 a.m. Exacto. Uh -huh. Exacto. Entonces estamos bien. 7 a.m. The otro essential body and the responsibility is the. Okay, what are you interested in the position? Vaya, ahí se la voy a mandar y, y para que estemos en línea. Para que me Yo, si es así, what are you interested on the position? ¿Es así? Yo diría, compañeros, que entre todos hagamos el cuestionario, ¿verdad? Lo respondamos entre todos y después cojamos las preguntas que queremos, que podemos, eh, o sea, que nos pueden preguntar y podemos con contestar a la vez, ¿verdad? Sí, porque así me parece injusto porque agarran las más fáciles o... Así no, que yo digo lo, que lo digan que, tres, tres y la que... No, no lo, lo que pasa es que así ya nos coordinamos en la idea, ¿verdad? De, por lo menos si hacemos un como un folleto, como una hoja de, de perfil a llenar, ¿verdad? Ajá. Mi nombre, está, o sea, el nombre del... ¿Usted quiere que las respondamos todas y después no, hagamos digamos. las preguntas, las vamos contestando y ya tenemos toda la información, todos nos repartimos eh, a quién le van a preguntar y qué vamos a contestar cada uno, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ahí se fue, sí, ¿verdad? Sí, eso estoy viendo. Oh, bueno. viendo ok. Vaya, pero entonces... Eh... Estaba poniendo rara la conversación, sinceramente. Hola, hola. Estaba poniendo rara la conversación. <ríe> sí, eh, bueno. Ahorita creo que somos cuatro, pero, pero igual, eh, Gilberto, creo que tenemos que definir en algún momento. Ah, do, dos y dos. Sí. Dos y dos, cabrón. Los entrevistados serían sí. Daniela y... y... Y yo, pues, me pueden uh -huh. entrevistar a mí, pues, no, pero haga, haga, hagamos una hoja de, ya de, de preguntas y respuestas uh -huh. para que nos repartamos, ¿verdad? Por lo menos en mi caso, ¿verdad? si yo voy a, a su empresa, yo pediría uh -huh. para vendedor, ¿verdad? Sales men. Uh -huh. me dice, yo, yo título, o sea, ¿qué trabajo necesito? Yo, yo título, ¿verdad? Pero Vaya. es que nos tardaríamos mucho si lo hacemos así. Vaya, sí, es mejor voy. dar dos preguntas y las respondemos. Así, dos preguntas a cada uno. Vaya. Okay. ¿Qué pregunta me haría usted, mi? Vaya, le voy a Para poner... yo ver cómo, cómo le podría... Le, le voy a poner aquí, eh, vamos a ver, el entrevistador dice, hi... Eh... Sí, el saludo es normal, ¿verdad? La introducción que usted puso está bien, me parece bien la, el saludo, ¿verdad? Ajá, eh, eh, pero o se lo voy a escribir para, para okay. digamos, hi Gilberto, ¿verdad? Hi Gilberto. Okay. Uh, thanks. Thanks for coming today. For, thank you for coming today. I am Carlos. Arseño. Y yo le digo, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Ok. Así voy a comenzar, ¿verdad? Ok. Este. No sé si quiero ver Cindy. Cindy, ¿usted cómo va a estar? Ahí está Cindy, ¿sí o no? Sí, aquí estoy. 
Eh, eh. Usted le va a preguntar también a Gilberto, pero no sé si, si o hagamos le... una cosa, usted le pregunta a Gilberto y yo a Daniela. Ah, vaya, vaya, ok. Ajá, para aquí. Ya okay. vais definiendo más. Guys, uh -huh. I, Hola. Uh, I have, have been listening to you and I guess you will need more time. Okay, don't worry. So you will have time. We're going to complete this, this activity tomorrow. So this time I'm going to move you to the main room. Okay. After the class, you can organize yourself or you can do it by chat. Um, and tomorrow at the, at the time of the class at 8 um, p.m., I hope you are ready. Okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Okay, good. Just let me... Um, just let me close the rooms, okay? See you at the main room. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Welcome back. Welcome back, everybody, everyone. Let me see who is missing. Okay, okay. Okay. Everybody is here. Okay, well, thank you so much. Um, um, how do you feel? Do you feel ready? Not yet? Do you, do you need more time? Yes, teacher. Yes. <laughs> okay, don't worry. So all of you will have time until tomorrow. So tomorrow we're going to have this activity uh, development. Um, um, let me see, yeah. First, you know, I present the next topic for the day, but this, this week will be about human resources, uh, vocabulary, terms, and uh, methodology and everything, right? So basically it will be related to the same topic all the week. And tomorrow we are going to continue, okay, with this activity. So if you haven't finished your ideas, try to do it later or tomorrow. Okay, before the class. Um, today, let me see, missing seven minutes. Okay, I promise to give you the difference between who and who, and also I have this other word that is who's. Okay, they, they are um, no the same, okay because they have different functions. <clears throat> okay, whose means uh, the quien, okay? Eso es el significado, es algo posesivo, okay? Whose book is this? So it, it, it means that you are asking a quien le pertenece ese libro, okay? That is one example, de quien es este libro. So, Another example that I have here, whose car is parked, is parked over there, okay? ¿De quién es el carro que está, el coche que está parqueado ahí? Teacher, teacher, excuse me, we do not see the screen. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. I I didn't realize about that. Teacher. There you, can you see it now? Hey, could you share the link of yes. the interview? In WhatsApp, please. I already did it. Ah, okay. Yeah. Did you re check it, please, if you receive it? Here is a conversation yeah, example. Yeah, checking. The conversation that we have before. 
and also I would send I will send the explanation here about these words. Okay. Who, whose, and who. Okay. So we were speaking that whose is possession. Okay. Like it's asking the quien. Okay. For example, whose book is this? Whose car is parked over there? Okay. Estamos preguntando de quien. Cuando vamos a preguntar algo que, de, que, que pertenece a alguien, then we use whose, okay? Okay. So, whom, whom es, okay, tenemos un sujeto en, y tenemos también un objeto en, en algunas oraciones, right? So, el objeto, in this case, will be whom, okay, whom. This is an example, whom did they choose? Whom, okay, they will be, uh, this will be, siempre va a tener esa función como object. Y el sujeto sería they, okay. okay. Whom did they choose? A quien eligieron ellos? A quien, ese es el objeto, okay. That will be uh, the function of whom. And who, it has the, the function of subject. Tiene la función de sujeto, okay? Uh, one example, who broke this window? Who, okay? El sujeto, who broke, who broke that window, okay? So I hope that you uh, understand the idea or the difference between them, okay? Who, who, and whose. There you have the link, I, I send it to you. The explanation is in Spanish. That will be easier for you to understand. And then we have examples in English, okay? Okay. Good, guys. Uh, just the last part, that will be the homework uh, 11, la tarea. La tarea 11. Okay. If you haven't finished the midterm, please do it. I can see that there's still some of you have that part missing. Midterm exam. Okay, we have the sections here. Section 3 will be the one that we are going to open now. Estamos justamente a la mitad del nivel, okay? Estamos ahorita en la clase 11. Okay. Number one. Will be talent manager, manager consultant or HR generalist. Oversees both the talent review and performance manage, management processes. Which one? Talent manager consult. Oversee both the talent review and performance management process. Okay. Number two, benefit specialists, HR generalists, develops appropriate strategies for clients regarding employee relation, disciplinary action operations. Human resource generalists. Okay, good. Compensation specialists, secretary work in a company in a company's human resource or personal department special specialist okay benefits specialists hr specialist is responsible for assisting with the administration of all benefits benefit specialist okay Accountant or administrative assistants handles administrative requests and queries from senior managers. Administrative assistant. assistant. Okay. Okay, very good. There you have all the answers. <clears throat> you can send it. And then the first uh, homework for section three will be done. Very good, guys. 
Thank you so much for your attendance today. I really appreciate it. That is everything for today. I don't know if you have questions before you go. No question. No question. No question. Okay, guys. See you tomorrow at 8 p.m. Okay, teacher. Good night. Good night. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Atentos en la noche. Good night. Good night. Good night.